Next up, we have Puerto Rico, played by Mars. I mean, he's a swordsman, he has a rapier, he has a cape. I wouldn't be surprised if Mars is some sort of Hispanic Spaniard or something. Although he is fighting against, like, a shielded, armored soldier. So we'll see how this goes this time. So, um, so I just recently got Marth. Marth is a recent addition to the Amiibo uh, collection I have so far. Um, so I would like to see how these two fight against. They have not fought against each other, by the way. So, um, that's something I like to point out. Is that, um, every single Amiibo that I, um, trained so far has not fought against each other. So they will not know much of their movesets. These have been training forever to see. So far, like, I feel like Samus is playing more defensively because I, I've noticed when I was training her, Samus like usually spammed more of her missiles and um, lasers. Like, she will sometimes go in for the kill, but sometimes she won't either. Puerto Rico really has gotta stop side dodging a lot because that could be her uh, disadvantage. Like, keep spamming it, and then Master Chief could finally have like a perfect opportunity to finish that. Yeah, see, you can see that right there. Master Chief keeps on like using his uh, projectile or her projectiles. Has it been ever? Has Master Chief ever been unmasked before? I mean, I know he has a voice, and he obviously sounds like a dude, but that could be like a voice module or something. Well, you could have wall jump, Samus. Oh, this is not gonna be the same thing. I feel like Link and Samus are like a good true couple here when it comes to falling off the cliff with no remorse whatsoever. But anyway, so, um, we've never seen Master Chief, like, unmasked before, like, him outside of the helmet. So, um, I don't know, could be a woman? <laughs> Who knows? Uh, yeah, unless, um, I don't, I don't know, unless I was mistaken or something, like, I have not played Halo 4. And the only Halo, the, like, the only resemblance of story I know about Halo is, like, a little bit of Halo 3, but I did not finish that game. I played a shit out of Halo 2, but that's mostly because of multiplayer at a friend's house. Um, and God knows I'm never gonna play multiplayer with the Master Chief Collection, but I will probably do a Let's Play for that um, game in terms of like single story, because as long as it's like unchanged or something, or maybe with a game balance, I will definitely um, consider doing a Let's Play for the Master Chief uh, Collection. Halo, uh, Halo 1 through 4. Maybe in the preparations for Halo 5, much like, um, how it's preparing the Metal Gear Solid series with, um, the, basically the anthrology of the entire Metal Gear Solid series, except for, like, I don't know, the Game Boy Color one. And, uh, uh, Portable Ops. So far, um, really it's anyone's game, though, but it seems like Puerto Rico has the advantage. Oh, Dodged in time, that's good, Master Chief. And once again, Master Chief has, um, like, 12 or 11 letters. So it's not like I was able to, like, fit much into the thing. So I tried M57R Chief. I just got rid of the vowels and made it look like Master. But it could, like, it might look like Mr. instead, but who knows. Anyway, so Marth won. But again, this is 2 out of 3, so... Master Chief might have the, uh... A chance, but we'll see if she'll be willing to take that chance or not. Survival. Second match of the well, second round of the second match. Who won? Let's find out. Three. Oh, wonderful 101. Go. I, I really do need to play that game. Like, I heard, like, first off, it's a Platinum Games, which I fucking like. Platinum Games is one of those companies where they mostly can do no raw, with the exception of Legend of Korra, but it's a licensed game, and th I'm pretty sure that's Activision's fault for not giving them enough time to develop the game in time. So I can't- WOW! Puerto Rico, you know you're spacing very well. Master Chief, you gotta work on your frame. So even if, um, Master Chief's the master of, um, keep away, Puerto Rico knows how to, um, attack with discretion. How the hell did that not hit? That down smash. <laughs> That's weird. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing much grabbing so far. I also see Puerto Rico like counter quite a lot, especially when I was um, 
playing against him. Uh, oh, careful. So, if he knows specifically when to counter, then he knows. Well, he can't counter that time because he was being punished. Same thing with that. Okay, so Master Chief might have a chance here. Who knows? We'll see. Ooh. And... Is this it? So far, it's not... See? Oh! Come on! Oh, that's not... Wow, you really love that side smash, huh? I, I wonder if you it's possible to train your Amiibo pool to just constantly do one move over and over again. I doubt it, but... Like, from what I've read during, um... Like, news articles, it seems like, um... Sometimes Amiibos tend to, like... Take more of the useful information. Like, if they do, like, one move all the time, that's not gonna work for them. And I guess that also pertains to the teabagging thing. Like, what's the point of teabagging? It's just similar to taunting, like there's not really much to do or much of a benefit to do so, other than to just troll I guess, but I don't know, I've seen sometimes Master Chief does it, sometimes he doesn't, who knows. Let me open the window and tie this bitch. Ugh. As long as there's no neighbors listening into my conversation, I think I'll be fine. Um, Master Chief is actually winning, so she might have a chance. I don't know why I'm referring to it as he or she, but oh, nice counter from Puerto Rico. Um, I've also played Wii Sports. I remember um most of the seniors. Is that like a golf course? I think I think that's like a golf course or something. Because that's not the actual island. I island's not that small. I don't remember that house whatsoever or the mountainside. That's the actual island where it takes place. Like the other islands are like more golf courses or something. Ooh, Puerto Rico's actually catching up. He might actually make a comeback. We'll see. That could have been a good punish. So yeah, even if they're in like level 50, it still takes them a while to um, learn how to master it. But I could see if you like train your amiibo like a shit ton, it can easily wreck your shit. <laughs> well, master Chief, are you gonna prove me wrong or are you just gonna let that slide in? Come on. So far, it's a really even match though. So. Oh! Oh, that's a close one. Oh. Very close match. Hope the timer doesn't run out. We have one minute and thirty seconds left. Oh, oh, oh! My sheep still. Is a Samus is a pretty heavy character, so she can take quite a lot of abuse. Oh no! Oh crap! Marth is not very much of a light character, and that side smash was, I think, like the sweet spot. All right, so this is gonna be the last round for this match. Whoever loses this one goes in the loser's bracket, fighting against Ryuchi. Survival. Place your bets down in the comment section, <laughs> even though it's pre-recorded. Let's... go. Three, two, one, go! Oh. <laughs> so you can't counter grabs, can you? Even if it's like an attack grab, like Ganondorf's up special or Bowser's side special. So those are the things you cannot counter, but you can counter projectiles and attacks. And if you counter attacks, that I think it's like doubles your knockback or something. Pertinent to the um, attack that was dealt to you that you countered. Oh, looks like Master Chief. What the hell was that spinning right there? Are were you trying to perfect pivot? I don't remember teaching you how to perfect pivot, Samus. At least I don't remember. Yeah, perfect pivoting to them seems a little bit wanky. It's, but I, I'm sure it's possible. Like I, I've been impressed with the amiibo so far. Like at first I was kind of a little bit leaning, like a little bit um disappointed from the amiibo since I can't really see much of benefit of it though. But I could see this being like a pretty huge and fun time waster, especially if you like want to pit against your friends like amiibos or something. Like I'm the kind, like I'm the kind of guy that probably gets like a shit ton of amiibos instead of like one caring amiibo like it, basically amiibos are like pokemons but in real life like they're basically there for you to fight alongside the battles except you don't need you can't have six at a time at the same time or something and um basically you train them you could feed them but i don't do that because i feel like that's gonna like ruin their competitively ruin them competitively and that's not gonna that's gonna like fuck up their attack stats their defense stat and their speed that i'm not gonna do that uh 
But yeah, Samus could take quite a lot of abuse. Like, she has a pretty good defense boost already, but... Combine that with her level 5 amiableness, that's just gonna leave... No marks. No scars. <laughs> wow. Master Chief, are you liberally trying to get hit from that? You're not- Oh! Oh! That's a close one. I would love to see a Meteor Smash from either one of their characters, because I've seen it so far. But, um... I haven't really experienced them doing it that much. Oh, that's not... The, the up smash, um, her up smash attack, seems like... <laughs> I also want to try and teach their amiibo to, like, jump on the opponent's heads as they try to, like, recover and stage. So far, Master Chief, you might actually lose this one because, yep, you lost. Puerto Rico, like, has two stocks already, so even if he loses one, he still has one backup unless Master Chief can, like, make a huge comeback. So, Puerto Rico will be joining in with, uh, Zelda in the winner's bracket. Master Chief, you'll be joining in with Ryuchi, which, by the way, it's time for the elimination round! Survival. 